Hi guys, my name is Masood and today I'm going to talk about green synthesis of copper nanoparticles. These are the materials which you need for the synthesis of copper nanoparticles. Copper sulfate, pentahydrate, perchuluca, oleacea seeds, press, coriaria fruits, hydrochloric seed, sodium hydroxide, 0.01 molar stack solution of copper sulfate pentahydrate that was prepared by dissolving 0.25 grams of the copper sulfate salt in 100 milliliter deionized water. A 2% hydrazine solution that was prepared by taking 2 milliliter of hydrazine solution in 100 milliliter of deionized water. The first step is preparation of res coriaria or sumac extract. The plant extract was prepared by boiling 2 grams of dry, well grinded press coriolis or sumac foods for 20 minutes, filtering and completing to 100 ml of deionized water. The extract was stored at 4 centigrade degrees for further experiments. The next step is synthesis of nanoparticles using sumac extract. To synthesize nanoparticles using sumac as stabilizer, 3 ml of plant extract were added to 1 ml of copper sulfate pentahydrate with the concentration of 0.01 molar 2 ml of uh, sodium hydroxide with the concentration of 0.01 molar and 1 milliliter of hydrazine at room temperature, then complete the volume to 10 milliliter with the ionized water. And you can see the reduction reaction that happened. Then the mixture was heated for 10 minutes in water bath. The solution color changed from faint blue to pale yellow and by heating become deep red. That, uh, that is our reference to prepare this video, green synthesis and characterization of copper nanoparticles. Okay guys, thank you for watching this video. If you like this video and you are interested in nanotechnology and nanoscience, Please subscribe us. Bye-bye.